Arts Champions is an exciting and innovative project run by the Hippodrome and Sampad to bring arts to life in the local community. It's amazing. The most exciting was probably learning about the different culture that there was in Birmingham. It's brought the entire community together. It's included people engaging in storytelling, music, drama and oral history. I just want them to know what life was like when we were young. I liked that we like learned about different people in history. We're here to devise a piece of theatre that reflects the local history of Birmingham and its four constituents, so that's Bartley Green, Quinton, Harborn and Edgebaston. The first story really that we identified is the story of Jane Bumford. Read all about it! World's tallest woman found here in Bartley Green! She was the world's tallest lady at her time. She actually had the world's longest hair as well. Um, her hair was eight foot in length when she died. Personally, I've just got a wonderful experience. I've been able to devise something and bring ideas. I've been able to go and see things I never get to see. I actually found just using the subject that I love for something that I find really interesting to do for the community. Absolutely amazing. Working with the Hippodrome has been such a delight. One event organised by Arts Champions was a family fun day at the Barber Institute where art and music activities were inspired by the history and a portrait of Lady Barber. We've been having fun mainly. Well, we've been uh, singing, playing instruments and having a well at the time. Really enjoying it. Love that music. So it's uh, nice and lively, and uh, everybody joined in, and uh, it was really nice. I enjoyed it. We've been listening to some stories. Capern actually lived in Harbour, not very far away from here. He was the postman poet. I've enjoyed the poem. One Edward, the postman who had the, who was also a poet. This is the start of one of his poems. Oh, the postman's life is a happy one. And these are the things that I see. Oh, he saw some trees. Can you describe a tree for me? The trees were big. Yeah. The, the, the tree was as big as an elephant. The tree was as big as an elephant. So I want, can we put some actions with it? I liked it when I was a character. Tree was as big as a... Oh, we've got an... Oh, yes. Well, my daughter loves reading, so events at the library as well, stories and activities to bring stories to life, I think it's really important, so that's why I think it's really important to have events like this. Do you want to make one final line? Yeah. What, 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 what should we... What, what else can we say? Do you want to have a little think about it? The grass was as green as emerald. Oh, beautiful. And what, what can we do for our actions for that? The grass. Oh, the grass. Was as green. As, um, as, and the emeralds are sparkling, are they? I love that. So the grass was as green as emeralds. I've been uh, delivering historical stories and also making peg dolls, which are little figures related to each of the stories, and uh, working generally in the community um, to engage people through storytelling and visual arts um, with the history of the area. I like, um, we learned like different people about stories and we learned how to make the puppet. Oh, it's very important to look back and remember. I love knowing about the history before me. And I think when they're grown up or like you, they will want to know my history. What would you like to tell me about? It's, it's like about growing up, you know, when you were a child. We were very, very poor. And would you believe when I was first born, we didn't have any electricity. I was born with the, the trash before it never set up a policy. 
But when I was born, it was plastic. I've had some wonderful times. I enjoyed every minute of it. I went to London when I was 17, and war was declared a fortnight later. I was in charge of casualty at night. And I'm not kidding you. Life was very, very hard. All hell used to break loose. It was really frightening, that part, until the police came in and they used to line all across the pub, the bar. There's no such word as crime. You can do anything, so long as you put your mind to it. I think it's wonderful to look back. It makes you sad sometimes. Arts Champions Edge Baston has been a fantastic engagement journey for us and we're really looking forward to continued work with the partnerships that we've built here.